three accessories that have been banned in the NFL. And first up, we have a player who always stepped onto the field looking good, no matter how much it cost him. Clinton Portis at the time didn't agree with Washington's choice to go with white socks with their red jerseys. So when their next game rolled around, him and his teammate Sean Taylor both wore red socks instead, later being fined $5,000 each for the incident. Not taking no for an answer, Portis wore the same pair to the next game, receiving an even larger fine of $10,000. And next up, we have a player who, unlike Portis, was completely unaware he was breaking any rules. Most are aware of the NFL's strict rules on what players can wear on and off the field, but Wes Welker didn't get the hint until it was too late, receiving a $10,000 fine for wearing a band hat for 16 consecutive weeks. Welker was definitely less than thrilled, taking his frustration out on Twitter. And last up, we have the time Cam Newton was fined over $10,000 for wearing clips on his helmet. As much as Newton loves to dress for the occasion, the NFL has made it very clear all branded gear is banned, regardless of how easily visible the logo is. The NFL has a ton of rules, so here are 